That's right. The new ribbon board is up. The lines on the field are painted. Many of the seats have cushions on them. Sponsors have their signs up and the concessions are open just in time for the arrival of the Vanderbilt Commodores and of course, Purdue football fans. The Vanderbilt football team arrived at ross -Aid Stadium a little after nine this morning, filling campus with even more black and gold as they unloaded all of their gear. I think maybe I need to go head over there and do some intimidation. Purdue graduate student James Geis says he went to every Purdue football game last year, and this year will be no different. The game is going to take up my whole day. We got tailgating in the morning, game, and then celebrate afterwards. Tomorrow is the Hammerdown Cancer Game. The Boilermakers will honor cancer survivors by wearing neon yellow cancer awareness ribbons on the back of their helmets. All cancer survivors or people currently fighting cancer will be asked to stand and be acknowledged at the end of the first quarter. We recognize uh, all cancer survivors and those who are fighting the fight, those who have had people affected uh, by, by cancer. Also tomorrow, Purdue will recognize Tyler Trent on what would have been his 21st birthday. The T2 Gate honors the Purdue superfan who lost his battle with cancer on January 1st. The gate will be unveiled at a 10 in the morning ceremony, attended by his family and friends, along with Purdue President Mitch Daniels and Athletic Director Mike Bobinski. I think it's awesome. It's a great way to remember him for every football game and every time you're walking past the stadium, you can remember him and his legacy. Tyler Trent's parents will give away 300 copies of his book, The Upset, to the first 300 students through the gate. The Purdue Center for Cancer Research will also give away free Tyler Trent towels to the first 3,000 students who show up. He's just a remarkable human being, and it, it's sad that he's gone, but we're going to honor him however we can. Purdue students Nikhil Gavani and James Guy say they'll honor Tyler Trent by doing what he loved most. Boiler up. Boiler up. Let's go. Delivers underneath. Purdue Senior Associate Athletic Director Tom Schott says there will be nearly 50,000 people here at the arena tomorrow, but tickets are still on sale. In West Lafayette, Nina Slosberg, Star City News.